all right so what is going on today youtube man we got a lot to talk about today a lot of things happened over the past couple of days and uh yeah man kind of late to the party but you know it it's okay we're we're, we're going we're, i'm still gonna get there we're still gonna enjoy ourselves we're still gonna have a fun time so let's hop straight into the video um so yeah let's go ahead to start in the first card um that i want to talk about today is glow up bloom and if you guys haven't heard about it already which i'm pretty sure you are is a level one dark zombie tuner effect monster zero attack zero defense and the effect reads as follows you can use the first effect when this car with, with with this card's name only once per turn if this card is sent to the graveyard you can banish this card from your graveyard um you cannot special summon except for zombie type monsters and uh you can add a level five or higher zombie monster from your deck to your hand or if zombie world is in a in a field zone you can special summon it instead um so you guys uh yeah man this is uh this deck this structure deck is getting better and better by the day um my god i believe that's it i believe that was um what is it we have the, the we have we have a spell card we have a trap card i'm not sure if we're going to get any more exclusive stuff this is the seventh card but yeah man glow of bloom is you know like I, once again like most of these cards from this structure deck it is pretty much going straight into the deck this card right here is bonkers you can get into the uh level eight dragon you can summon uh endless decay you can summon ill blood from the deck you can summon so much stuff from the deck like oh man this this, this opens up so much potential and you guys already know that i'm gonna get into that so yeah man this card is just great i don't see any real drawback about it you can either add it to your hand or you can add it you know from the what's the name and then whatever whenever it's sent to the graveyard like are you kidding me god konami you 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 ooh 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 wee ooh wee um yeah man glow of bloom is is pretty good i can't wait to play with it and show you guys some combos i come up with it, some combos i think of and stuff like that so yeah man glow of bloom is, is uh, oh my god the structure deck is already a 10 so i don't even know how better you can get um with the structure deck so now we're going to move on to the surprise of the of the whole weekend for me besides the balance which was number one i guess on everybody's priority or surprise list uh we got a whole bunch of leaks last night but what today we're going to focus on uh is the shirai nui's yes we finally got some more shirai nui's and oh man am i excited all right so let's start it off by uh the uh this guy the level two zombie uh, effect monster you can only use this card's name one at well, basically once per turn if this card is in your graveyard you control two or more shirai nui's uh with different names you can special summon it from the graveyard but banish it when it leaves the field and then um if this card is banished you can target a zombie monster and gain 600 attack and defense uh yeah um it's okay i guess um it, it, it's all right it's not a tuner which is weird I, I thought it would be a tuner but it's not um that's that's just a little bit weird i feel like this card would have been a lot better if it was a tuner because then you can use um you can pretty much use it to go into uh you can pretty much use the synchro with any of your shuri nui's um but i'm guessing it's for the link because it's a link three um, so I'm guessing it's for that because it's basically when you get two on the field, you're pretty much going into this link. So yeah, pretty cool, I guess. Um, like I said, we'll have to play with it just to see what we can do. Uh, the next card, and oh my god, this card is just, oh, uh, once per turn. Uh, I mean, obviously you can only use their effects once per turn, but when this card is normal summon, you can special summon one spectral sword from, uh, oh wait, we're getting more. Oh, I didn't know that. We're getting more spectral swords. See, you can special summon, unless this is a mistranslation, you can special summon one Shiri Nui spectral sword monster from your hand or deck. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, we're probably getting another one. Oh, wait, that's, we have to be getting another one because that's weird. Why would you, why would you not say Shiri Nui spectral sword? You get what I'm saying? Okay, all right, okay. Uh, monster from your hand or deck. Also, you cannot. Uh, you can only spell some zombies for the rest of the turn. And then, if this card is banned, you can draw and discard one card. So you guys can already see where this is going. All right. So number one, I did not really, I guess, see that when I first read the effect. But I'm guessing we're getting another spectral sword type monster. So we are getting another tuner, which is good. I'm pretty sure it's most likely going to be a level four. Oh my god, if it's a level four. Oh, that's. Oh my god, if it's a level four. Just. Oh my god, can you guys think of the potential? this oh we can use the level four going to this make what's the name 4500 and then you get to draw and discard a card 
Come on, my guy. Oh, my God. We're, 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 we're in it to win it, folks. But we got to wait for that to get um, leaked or something. But the, the part I really do want to uh, talk about is the second effect, which is banish. You can draw a card and discard a card. This card, uh, I believe, um, in actually in Zombies, I know a lot of people don't like it. But, you know, once again, switch over to the dark side. Dwayne, I see you, man. Switch over to <laughs> Switch over to the dark side, man. But in that deck, um, instead of Spirit Master, you can send this. You can banish both of those for a Slayer. You get to draw a card because of this. Then you also get to Special Summon because you have Solitaire. And then also, once again, we still have Sucker's Effect to draw. We still have a Necro's Effect to draw. We have so much draw power in Zombies. It makes no type of sense. But I do love it. I do love it, man. This card right here is amazing. I cannot wait. I really hope we get a level four. Because I feel like it is. Because this is a weird way to say this. Unless it's mistranslated. Um, this is a weird way to put this. You you usually, or on most cards, you would just say Shared or Spectral Sword. But this is good. It's a free level six. Um, and then also when it gets banished, you can just draw and discard a card. That's, that's just good, man. Um, no, no qualms about this. This one's a little weird, but no qualms about this. Onto the Link and the Synchro. Uh, the Synchro, level 7. A little odd. I'm not understanding why they went to 7 all of a sudden. It should probably have been another level 6 uh, to help with this. And then now that kind of makes me think that Spark to Short, the, the other one's going to be a 3. Or maybe a 3 that turns into a 4 if you control shit. I, I don't know. Oh, that would be dope. Like, if the, the new tuner says, you, you can, once per turn, you can gain, you can increase this card's level by the number of Shiri News on the field, or up to the number of Shiri News on the field, that'd be kind of dope, though. That'd be dope. Uh, but anyways, let's not get our hopes up. Uh, you can spell someone, okay, obviously, once per turn. Uh, but this card, this second, this effect is pretty dope. When I first read it, I was like, oh, this is kind of, you know, okay. But then I thought about it, I said, hold this, this is actually pretty good. Um, but once per turn, you can banish one monster from your graveyard or faced up on your field. Then you can apply one or more of these effects in sequence depending on the kind of card it was. Zombie type, they all gain 300. Fire, uh, destroy a, a spell or trap. And then if it's a synchro, destroy one monster on the field. So, let's get this trait. Pretty much what we could do is go into this, banish a zombie. You pretty much banish a sheer needy synchro. Probably even banish it damn self. Um, and then what we can do is have all zombies gain 300. Then destroy a spell and trap and a monster. And I'm guessing that's what it means. I'm guessing that's what it means. And if that's the case, that's fucking broken. This card is super, super, super good. If that's the case, I'm pretty sure. Uh, wait, no. Wait, no. Yeah, you can. Yeah, one or more of these effects and see. Yeah. So, pretty much, when you banish a Shiri New, you automatically going to be getting two effects at least. At the, the, at the least, you're going to be getting two effects. If you banish a Synchro Zombie, you, you like I said, you're at least going to get two effects. So this card is just super fucking good. I really wish we had this earlier. It would have made the decks a lot better. And if it was during either player's turn, it would have been even better. But like I said, I cannot complain. This card is good. You can definitely clear the field with one of these. Uh, sadly, you can only special summon it once per turn. Man, if you can special summon this multiple times, you're, you're winning. You're, I'm trying to tell you, you're gonna, you're just gonna, we're gonna be able to break our opponent's boards. And with this card, though, we should be able to break a lot of boards because this can pop a spell and trap and gain attack and a monster. Fucking busted. I, I really do like that. Onto the link, link three, top left and bottom, two plus zombie monsters. Um, you can only use this card's name. Of, so we can special summon it more than once. That's actually really good. You can only use this card's name uh, effect one, third effect. Um, once, hey, what? Yeah, third effect once a turn. Uh, number one, Synchro Summon cannot be destroyed by battle. Fire monsters you control cannot be destroyed. Oh, wait, no, no. Synchros cannot be destroyed by card effects. Fires can Fire monsters cannot be destroyed by battle. And then uh, during opponent's turn, you can target a banished Synchro. Oh, okay. All right. That's actually, oh, this shit is good. This shit is really good. Um, I don't know why I didn't read. I don't know. I, I only read the first two parts for some odd reason when I read this. I didn't, I didn't never seen this part. That's, that, this is good. This is good, man. This 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 support is just fantastic. Whoever is at Konami, just give you a pat on the back, man. Thank you, Jesus. You see, this is what I'm talking about, man. Uh, OCG come out with the cards, man. If this was a TGD exclusive, it would say you're gonna summon it once per turn. You can only activate one effect per turn and only once that turn. Um, yeah, it's it. Uh, this card is great. I, I like it. The fact that you can special summon a banner synchro monster can't be destroyed by battle, and then synchro monsters can't be destroyed by card effects. That's really really good. So it protects itself from battle. So um all you have to do is really just try to protect it with um card effects and then the fact that you could just special summon any banner zombie synchro are you kidding me that's pretty fucking busted and then oh to your zone i thought it to to a zone this card points to because that would have been pretty 
that have been pretty hot to give your opponent something and stuff like that but yeah man i do like that that's actually pretty cool actually really cool i really like that man great, great effect great extra deck additions definitely going in the deck at least one of each at least one would definitely be going into a sherry new deck and on to the spell and trap and i'm pretty sure you guys already know about this spell this is this is what i'm talking about this is what we want you can only activate once per turn if your opponent controls a monster discard is not wait whoa they changed it this shit said discard one card it doesn't matter discard one zombie monster especially summon a sherry new monster from your deck or graveyard come do I even have to continue with this, folks? Do I need to continue with this? Do we even need to continue with this, folks? Do we? Do we? All right. All right. You already know what I'm about to say, but are you kidding me? Are you, are you telling me that I can get a solitaire from my deck or a graveyard? You telling me I can get a, a, a spirit master, not a spirit master, well, a samurai from my deck or graveyard? You telling me I can get any Shuri Nui? Yo, you gotta be shitting okay okay let's get it man this card is busted I, I mean this card is great what what else do you want me to say man this is what i wanted I, I, i've been talking about this this is stuff i want this is good there's no i don't only thing that i don't like is my opponent has to control the monster what i guess I man we have to we have to give him something we have to we have to ease up on our opponents with something man we have to at least give something up but that don't matter, man. We can get any Shiri new from deck or graveyard. We can get a synchro back from the graveyard. We can special summon in solitaire. We can special summon in samurai. If you watched my first video earlier today, you guys already know about samurai. You can pretty much just battle any monster. Bam. And you also you're discarding a zombie monster. So you can discard it a Shiri new monster. Special summon the you know the appropriate one. Now we can go to the Smith. We can go to Smith. Smith is what you want, man. And look. It doesn't need, you know what I, you know what the TCG would have made this if you control if your opponent controls a monster and you control no monsters you can activate this card even when you don't control them I mean even if you control four or five monsters because you got six I mean oh my god this card is busted you can interrupt your opponent discard a spirit master special summon samurai use samurai's effect pop if you have the level seven in your graveyard you can just you can discard a zombie special summon oh wait, it's not a quick effect but you guys you, you can special summon the link oh my all right okay we you, you know we're getting into some sure you know what this might have been an all zombie week but shadows did come off the list so i gotta play some 14 year olds but damn it we got we but you know what you guys might get three 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 different videos we might get a tcg extra link zombies we might get uh the zombie uh the stormy structure deck a version of zombies and then we're also gonna get a pure sure you deck that's it man i I'm, I'm excited i'm just can't wait can't wait man and then last but not least the trap card um once per turn with both effects you can special summon a zombie monster from your hand but banish it when it leaves the field and then you can banish this card from your graveyard target a zombie monster and it becomes effect unaffected by other card effects for the rest of the turn this most likely won't get played but god damn it does it matter does it matter this card is just amazing oh my not this card but uh did oh my god this thank you thank you konami whoever works at konami who did the zombie support thank you thank you please man I'll send you a thousand thank yous please thank you oh my god and then lastly but not least i believe this one just came out um it's it's the last spell card i guess for the uh structure deck um if my my computer would uh kindly load it jesus christ man do we need a new computer as ever um yeah the last uh what's the name is undead struggle you can only use this effect once a turn you can target a zombie monster in the field you can either gain it lose it you can either gain it or lose a thousand attack don't know i mean i guess it's for your opponent and then if it's in your graveyard shuffle one of your banished zombie monsters into the deck and if you do set this card to your field and if this will set of banishes when you the field i wonder if this is a quick effect in the graveyard because it is a quick play spell because you can activate the traps effect on your opponent's turn because it's a trap card so i wonder if this is also like that i'm not sure we haven't really had quick play spells that do this but um, yeah, it, it's, I just, I mean, <laughs> I don't know what you guys really would, yeah, it's, it's, it's there. Uh, what, what number is this? Oh, wait, what, did I read that wrong? Did I, li <laughs> I literally read the seven and said, oh, that, that's the number. No, it, this is 24. So that's pretty deep though. No, oh, it's a spell. Never mind. They do it. Mind. Anyways. Yeah, man, that is it for today. Uh, to go over everything. This is okay. Glow Bloom is oh my god, and then the Shiri New supporters oh my god, yeah man. So just expect them videos, man. 
expect them videos we're definitely gonna be shooting out some videos this week man uh, but anyway thank you guys for watching let me guys let me know your thoughts on the new support did i miss anything i feel like i did if you guys uh, know anything that i missed definitely let me know down in the description i mean comments below besides that that is it for today how long was this video guys i don't know because i was just so excited oh 15 minutes I, yeah yeah i'll deal with a 15 minute video i'm pretty sure you guys can handle it but anyways thank you guys for watching i hope you guys do enjoy the video leave a like comment and also subscribe if you haven't already and if you guys um do want to help support the channel links are in the description down below also you guys can click and add um any help would be appreciated thank you very much i will see you guys tomorrow be ready man because we're gonna be going in with some zombies oh man well, this is gonna be a fun week